Okay, here we go. Uh, a lot of you guys have seen um, the first part of this uh, video. It was where I bought uh, this bandsaw on that base. And the reason I bought this is because that bandsaw will come apart. Oops, wrong finger. <laughs> right here. Um, I'm going to show you a little bit of what's going on. I've been very busy. Um, it looks like organized chaos out here. And it really is. Mm, nah. It's just a little chaos. <clears throat> I am finishing up a CNC machine, right, which is a plasma cutter. For those who are informed, a CNC plasma machine uses a plasma cutter. But this is a pilot arc plasma cutter. So um, it doesn't have to make contact with the metal to get started. Okay, so I'm finishing that up from another project last year. I have this, um, which I'm working with right now, and I have separated it, and I have marked here and here and a center hole uh, to make my extension. The other part of the extension, I don't see it right now, but it's an 11 inch piece of C channel, which I cut off from this device. And right there you can see it. Right there you can see where I cut it out. Okay. Little man saw. I got my little MIG. It's Harbor Freight MIG. I put tank on it. It does both aluminum and it does steel. And I got to tell you, this is a dynamite outfit since I put this tank on there. Okay, so uh, you see uh, I'm a Harbor Freight kind of guy. I got a Harbor Freight grinder, Harbor Freight welder. Uh, yeah, that's about it right now, but by golly, things are starting to come together. I'm looking forward to other components coming in this week, and I will talk to you later. Thank you for listening and viewing, too. Chaos. Oop. I'm also putting some concrete in the driveway. Yeah. Hey. Things are looking up. See you in a week or so. Bye-bye.